Welcome back, Cordleys, to more might and fucking magic! Still fucking around with trees and shit. I need to put up my uh, guard dog so I can't be surprised, even though it doesn't really seem to do shit. Dino Lizard! For those curious, I'll probably be doing the uh, Super Nintendo version of Might and Magic 2 again. It's far superior graphic, graphically and audio-wise. I'll probably switch to PC for 3 and onward, though. Even though I believe there was a 3 Super Nintendo version, the uh, Might and Magic 3 for the PC is when the sound cards and the VGA started coming out. Uh, and I'd always prefer to play PC versions of these games, but... Sometimes it's just better to go console for LP reasons. Um, the PC version is also crazy, crazy harder. Which is fun for a self-gratification type of thing, but... On the grand scheme of things, doing it... Uh, for an LP, it's probably better to go with the slightly easier version. This is by no means, as you, if you've seen uh, all the videos I've done for this, is a walk in the park. I mean, it's pretty fucking vague what you're doing anyways. I've spent more time researching and looking up and trying to figure out where to go and what to do with this game than any other game I've let's play. Easily. Uh, and I think it's it's going to kind of reach true. Now, when you get to, like, the Might and Magic, like, 3, 4, 3, especially 4 or 5, World of Exene, and the later 6, 7, 8, uh, Might and Magic, it's a lot easier... Uh, especially with the later ones, they you know you get the quest compendiums and the journals and shit. And uh, I didn't have any trouble beating. Uh, I beat pretty much uh, four and onward, all the way to ten, I think. This might have been ten, right? I can't remember. Or maybe I'm thinking of Wizardry. But anyways, um, yeah, they get a lot easier. This this one and the second one are probably the vaguest of the two. This one being the vaguest of any in the series. So, once I get this done, um, and I get things rolling, holy shit balls! Got some of these strong orcs again. I'm trying to think if it'd be- eh, let's try this. Might be able to take out a couple. That 26. No! Ow, 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 I'll give you the chopper! Tuck tail and ran away like a little bitch. See, that's what I didn't want to happen. Clot is fuckalized. I mean, honestly, Gank is goddamn near worthless. I mean, at least my spellcasters have spells. Gank just is fucking useless. I would rather have a third wizard or another cleric. There's gotta be something to make him better. I mean, the motherfucker can't even shoot half the time. He's a puss. The fucking puss. Seriously? Now I'm gonna get fucked up by a one hit point orc. Oh, good. Oh, that's not good. That's not good.
That's good. Yeah, once your cleric gets paralyzed, see now if Gank was a cleric instead of a pussy robber, I'm gonna have to rest there. Alright, trudging along in Treeville. Smoking them trees. Fucking pussy unicorns! Stay and fight! Seriously? So I'm saying, my level 9 robber is attacking the kobolds first because he's pointless to use against the fucking cave. Something is wrong with that. I'm going to paralyze the kobold. I'm going to do shit! Not shit! Oh yeah. Oh yeah, of course. Actually, I'd rather have a third wizard. Cave uh, fireballs and, and bolts and all that's so much more worth my time. I'm gonna make sure that I build the correct party in the next game. Cause this is just... Holy shit! Lug Lug hitting for them triple digits, or Malice hitting for triple digits. That's a good thing or a bad thing? Sounds like it could be cursed. Naked underneath it. There you go, kill a gremlin, gank. It's about all you're worth. Fucking ridiculous. I mean, then again, gank, okay, I take it back. He opens all the chest and gets rid of traps. That's really his main fucking purpose in life. And clock can't cast because I'm fucking confused. Oh, flash. Okay, no one can cast because we got flashed. It was a detriment to our vision. And of course you missed. I like how all the orc leaders are hanging out together today. Sipping on some scissor. 
And the militia man ran away like a little fucking bitch. Four attacks. I think, the, I think the levels cap out at 20, so I'm assuming we can get more and more attacks going on here. It's gonna be really nice to start doing four and five attacks. I'm gonna really start fucking shit up. Okay, let's put Gank to work. set of trees. And we're gonna rest. Because we just took a lightning bolt to the tip of my penis. And it blew out the tip of my shoe. Cerebus Werewolf up the butt. We did not care for the anal rapage. Swarm! Yeah! I mean, it's a great spell to get rid of the weak shit. It makes the combat a lot quicker. Shaka Laka! Welcome to the Might and Magic Ghetto! Okay, well that was a whole can of fucking eat my shit. Jesus. So gay. Two people got diseased. It's extra gay. Gayer than gay marriage. Which I'm totally cool with. I think that was the last tree, but there's only one way to find out. We need to return to Dingleberry back in the grove. I don't even think we get experience for completing this quest. But that's okay, we're gonna be doing a, another quest here as well. Known as the Magic Square Quest. Which will give us plus two intelligence, a couple thousand experience, and some other fucking yum yums. Wow, you did jack shit. I'm attacking insects with insects. That's probably why they're like handshaking and fucking having insect orgies. 
and not really attacking each other like they're supposed to be. Which pisses me off! Not even about letting the enemy attack anymore. Just total fucking carnage. Okay, that's it. I think. Done. What is your pleasure? Gold item or a gem? Fuck, I guess I'll take the item. I mean, how much gold am I gonna get? I don't fucking know. Shit. Guess I'll take the item. It's probably a dagger. Youth Potion. Okay. I think we get a spell that fixes all that anyways, but... Somebody got hit with aging. I'm not sure if it actually took off. We're all 25 years old. God damn, I wish I was 25 years old. <laughs> I wish I was 35 years old. I'll take that too. Alright, let's head to this magic fucking square shit. Ladder going up. Take it. No, fuck your mother. So the magic square here is a mathematical phenomenon where different numbers are placed in rows and columns to form a square in such a way that all sums vertically, horizontally, and diagonally equal the same fucking number. This is not a scientific definition, but merely my attempt to you subscribers at explaining it. They often have more solutions. Here, however, only one particular solution is accepted. In which case, I have pulled up the cheat. Because I'm really not in the mood to do math. That's why I got an English degree, you fuck nuggets. So anyways, I'll explain as we go here. This is the upper left door. Okay, some of these are already preset, I think. This is one of them. Oh my god, this is the worst. All 
Alright, so... The next one on the top row we're gonna do... We're gonna set this to the number three. Trying to get this map correctly. If you don't have the light casted, you don't get to map it, so. This will give you a better idea of what I'm talking about by the time we get the puzzle complete. As far as the, uh, the look of the map, which is basically just a big square with a bunch of squares in it. This is the third one on the top from the left. We're going to set this to two. And open the door we just opened. All these doors automatically lock behind you. The last one is uh, preset to 13, so we don't need to worry about that one. Second row on the far right. I'm gonna set this one to 8. Skip, they're preset, so go all the way to the end. You now the light spell in this game sucks balls, by the way. We're gonna set this one to five. Third row down, far left. Setting this to nine. Shit, an encounter! Fuck me running! Ogre Chiefs! That doesn't sound fun. Holy shit! A lot of fucking monsters here.
That's a fucking shitty fireball. And you attack the wrong fucking thing there. Boom! Club to the dome piece. And we're getting all kinds of fucked up now. All right. What the fuck, man? Seriously? Here's where the game decides to cheat. Okay, just keep attacking, sure. Awesome! I just got anally raped. I'm gonna die and have to reload. I guess uh, I'm fucked. <laughs> oh well. Time to reload in town and come back to the magic circle. And I didn't save recently and that's not good. Anyways, I'm going to try not to break anything and I'll see you next time.